Arrow. Hey, keep it going. One strike from a shutout. Here it comes. And he struck him out for out number three. So that'll wrap things up here as they leave the possible tying run stranded at first. A 2 nothing finish today. The Rubber Ducks took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Rubber Ducks, two runs, seven hits, no errors. They left nine runners on base. Time for minor league baseball here on the show as we set our sights on the double A Eastern League. Today it's the rubber match of this three. Play ball. Stepping in, Sean Fields. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And he fouls this one off. One out, nobody on. And it's fouled away. Coming down in buckets. Cats and dogs. Insert metaphor here. And the forecast is not showing any signs of relief. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Jonathan Lopez. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And here's the 3-2 from him. Oh, double play ball to second. Four. Six. Three, and they turn the double play. Play ball. Ready now, Sean Fields. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. Fouled away. The 1-1. One, one. Now a changeup is bounced to second. Fielded cleanly. On, here, now that's here, out here, number here. one. What's the play ball? He's out. Now at the plate, Sean Fields. 0 for 2 First on his baseball. line thus far. First delivery to him on the way. Field. Fouled off. So far on the year, Fields is carrying around a sparkling slugging percentage up over 500. Obviously a huge threat every time he grabs a bat. 0-2. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. Hey, nice the discipline has just been completely absent from this offense. Seems like they're always finding themselves behind the count, and, and a big reason why is they're swinging at all kinds of stuff that's not even in the strike zone. Let's go now. One time. The 0-2 home. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ballgame, and that one ends. Play ball. Ready once again, Kevin Helton. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. Kevin. Ground ball to second. This could be two. Scooped up. There's one. On to first, but not in time as he's in there ahead of the throw. What's the play ball? You're out. So coming to the plate, Sean Fields. Oh, now. First pitch of the at bat. Count 1 and 0. All right, come on now. One time, let it fly. Come on, big guy. You got this. And a fastball in there for a strike. 1 and 1. Just behind the fastball yeah, there, two strikes now. Two strike. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get hey, that front fly, foot down early right and get ready or he's going to throw it right by you. And this is hit hard to the right side, but foul. The next one, two pitch. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. This pitching staff has done a real... 7-2 the final score this afternoon. The Rubber Ducks took the lead in the second inning and rode the that until duck. the very end.
Always looking to fill needs, clubs will explore every way a prospect might be capable of contributing. Minor League Baseball is live. And Play ball. Coming to the plate now, Sean Fields. Hitless in four tries in the ball game yesterday. Fields. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. No balls and one strike. Two out here and a runner at second. Swung on and fouled as it looked to make it all the way up into the concourse area. Come on, baby, square it up. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Let's play ball. He's safe. Here we go now. Come on now. Riding in, Sean Fields. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. Hey, he's right here one time. Now a swing and a miss, and things are not looking real promising here. Down 0 2. Find me a barrel right here. And it's one, one and two. two. You know, I'm not sure he didn't throw that pitch out of the zone on purpose. Come on. They've been swinging at pretty right much here. everything he throws, so why not give it a shot? Ball. To two balls hey, and two, two strikes right now. Two and two. Well, he kind of got caught yeah, chasing go, the first ball. two pitches out of the strike zone. But I think he's caught on to their game a little bit right now. Two tough pitches that he took with two strikes. And now the count is two and two. And a swing and a Digging in for his second at bat, Thomas Malone will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. And he pops it up. Short is there, and the side is retired. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. Stepping up now, Sean Fields. He'll start things out as we begin the fifth. And oh, ooh, no. I'm not sure you can get fooled Field. worse than that. It's 0 and 1. Behind 0 and 2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Lane, a native of Washington, the evergreen state. He throws a four seam fastball, a slider, and, and a two seam fastball. A ball and two strikes now. Got him, and he goes down on strikes for the third time. It's been a rough night at the yard for him. Now at the plate, Sean Fields. Here's the first pitch to him. Committed to that one a bit too soon as it locks him up for strike one. 
I'll tell you, he just doesn't look comfortable in a box to me tonight. He's been off balance with his swings, and that one completely tied him up. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. See it, drive it right here. Come on, big. Ball that took Looked there. like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. Hey, your pitch, your pitch. The two one. Waves and misses for strike number two. He is in complete command out on the mound today. He's got all four corners locked in, and now he's raising eye levels to boot. He's set. Here's the 2-2. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to 3-2. and two. That was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on 2-2, two and two, but when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's obviously easy to take that one. But right at the shortstop for the Let's second out. Settling in now, Brian Uribe. The right fielder, number seven, Brian Uribe. Hit the other way out toward right field. Right fielder is on the run, and now it'll rattle up against the wall. Aguilar blows through the stop sign, headed for home. He scores, and they are now on the board, though still well behind. Take a look at this right here. He didn't get... He's out. Stepping into the box, Sean Fields. A hat trick already to his credit in this one, so he's looking to avoid the dreaded golden sombrero here. A ball and no strikes. Come on, guy. Get your pitch up there. Lifted the other way out to left center. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Play ball. Bottom of the inning now, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Woody Lopez. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back in. And he will pull into second with a leadoff double. And he'll get in there safely. Of course they feel good about the triple, but I know how managers Play thinking. Ball. Now in the box, Angel Aguilar. He could really Number use four. a knock here, 0 for Angel. 3 in the game so far. Aguilar. High fly ball out to deep right field. Looking up is the right fielder. And goodbye, this one ain't coming back. Wow, that's what a pitcher gets for not putting what he... And tonight's final, 7-3. to three. Erie used a three-run seventh to help propel them to the, the win. Franklin Perez gets the, the win on the mound his first of the year. On 16 hit. What error. They left an incredible... The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Tonight, game two of this four-game weekend set between the Erie Seawolves and the Trenton Thunder. It's baseball on the show. James Reeves, a hurler from South Carolina, will be the starting pitcher in this one. What do we need to know here, Danny? You know, it's awfully tough in today's game when your strikeout to walk ratio. Stepping into the box, Sean Fields, right as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Ambergy is there now, and it's two pitches, two out. What's the play ball? Out. He's safe. So stepping in, Angel Aguilar. The season the batting average play. comes in down Angel. in the two forties. Aguilar in the air out toward right field. Yeah, here we go. Relay, relay. Fields is there, two down. Standing in, Sean Fields. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Oh, what a pitch to start the at bat there. It's nothing in one. Third inning, no score to this point. 
well above the letters with the fastball that time. Wow, kind of an interesting pitch call there. The batter flailed at the pitch away on the previous one. He'd go right back there, but instead they decided to come in, make him prove he can adjust before you do. The one-two. That's outside. What pitch recognition right there. 90% of the guys are going fishing after that nasty slider. Got him looking with the fastball as that had some two-seam movement to it. Two gone. Boy, he's What's having a heart. He's safe. Standing in, Sean Fields will start things out in their half of the sixth as they look to shake things up here for a lineup that, quite frankly, has been non-existent to date. No doubt about that, Matt. They've been completely overmatched to this point. One hit through five innings. I mean, what else can you say about the pitching they faced other than it's been fantastic? We'll see if that continues as we approach the later inning. Play ball. Ladies and gentlemen. Hey, drive that pitch, huh? Here you go. All set for the start of the inning. And digging in is the outfielder, Sean Leading Fields. For Erie. The right fielder. On to the what eighth are? now as the first pitch is a fastball that's looked at for ball one. Looked like that one tied him up a bit, a swing and a miss. This offense has been underachieving all day, putting way too much pressure on their own pitching hey, staff. Someone has there, to have a quality A-B and get this line going. A ball and two strikes now. That's the exact spot to lean on as a reliever. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and look for the next one. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Oh, man, he's been... At the plate, Angel Aguilar. It the was a flyout for him in his last trip. Angel. Here's Aguilar. the 0-1. Skied into straightaway right. Fields is there to put it away for route number one. Play ball. And tonight's comes to a conclusion. 6-1 to one the final. The Thunder took the lead in the fourth and held on until the Fans end. James Reeves first, earns the win his the second. Six runs on 12 hits. No errors. They left 11 men on base. The show's continuing coverage of Eastern. Paul Shaver, a right-hander from the state of Iowa, gets the starting assignment. What do you have for us on him, Danny? This guy has three pitches that he brings into his mix. And if he has all of them working, he has a chance to be really solid. A good pitcher, but he needs command of all three of his pitches. At the plate, Sean Fields. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Here's the pitch. And he fouls this one off. Temperature here at game time, 61 degrees. Come on, baby. Get your pitch. Right now. Hey. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. O2 is a fastball that misses inside. One and two now. Hey, that 0-2 fastball wasn't yeah, even close, right but I'm hit right now. I'm still sitting on that heater. Changeup <laughs> laid off down around the shins. He got ahead with two good fastballs oh, and then tried to drop right the changeup to see if he'd be out in front. Did a great job of laying. Pitch right there. Three Interested ball, to see where right. he goes now. Three and two, full count. Bases are empty, one man out. And it's fouled away. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put on, that pitch in play time. right in his wheelhouse. And he misses with it, ball four. So it's a one out walk here in the top of the first. Man, that's just painful for a pitcher right there. A 3 2 offering that was right on the corner, but he couldn't get him to chase, and he doesn't get the call. Can't beat yourself up about that one too much. Pitch, huh? That is third. 
Now at the plate, Josh Lester. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Hammers it to deep right field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. So here's the cleanup hitter, Cody Clemens. The second baseman. Cody Fields leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. Throw over to the bag. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. So it's no runs on no hits, no errors, and a runner left. At the plate, Thomas Malone. He's got hits in each of the last five ball games. Thomas Malone. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Fields is right there as he takes it for the second out. What's the play ball? Three. 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 Out. Ball four. Take the ball. You're out. Out. New inning set to get underway, and standing in the outfielder, Sean Fields. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. They can do it, no one better, come on. He's ready, here's the first offering. Swung on, but fouled off to the left. Oh, one pitch on its way. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Hey, come on, big dog. Get your pitch. This is in the air out to right field. Uribe is there, and he'll bring this one in. Play ball. Next will be the designated hitter, Kyle Holder. The designated The one-two. Kyle Holder. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Fields is there, and he makes the catch for the out. Let's play ball. Into the box now, Sean Fields. He flew out in his last at-bat. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. 
Even though we're still in the early going, I think this game's at a tipping point right now. They've got a chance to put this game out of reach, but if they can't score any more here, the other guys feel like the door's still open. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Come on, big guy. See it, drive it. See it, drive it. This is hit to third. Is he going to get out of this? Five, five. He is. A bit unconventionally, perhaps, but it works out in the end, and the inning is over. So they pick up no runs on two hits, no errors, and they leave the bases loaded. To the bottom of inning number four we go. The Seawolves are out on top, three to nothing. So striding in, Sean Fields. First pitch coming, here it is. On the ground to second base, this could be two. To second for one, on to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Digging in, Angel Aguilar, a hit in two tries so far. The 2-1 home. Heading out towards shallow right. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. Coming to the plate now, Sean Fields. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh inning. And that swung on and missed for strike oh, one. Pitch, pitch. I kind of like the aggressive attitude right here. I know he's in a jam. What does he do? He goes to his best stuff, and that's the fastball. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. Reined in. And he will apply the tag himself, and the inning is over. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. Seventh inning stretch time here at the ballpark. The Sea Wolves lead it 8 to nothing. Now batting, Thomas Malone. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Thomas Malone. The 2 1. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Fields is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. So it's two runs here on two hits. Eight to two tonight's final. Erie took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Tyler Alexander notches his third the win of the year. Paul Shaver couldn't escape season, the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. Years. No errors. They left 14 men on base. Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Brody Kerner, a Virginia-born right-hander. Into the box now, Sean Fields. He's been a non-factor in the series. No hits to this point. Into the corner and slicing foul. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. High and deep go, to straightaway right. Go, go, right fielder go, go. looking up, still going back. Gone! A solo shot here to straightaway right field. Home run number five on the year, and that will break the seal early here. It's quickly one to nothing. What a way to get things started while playing on the road. Top of the first and a big fly, just like that, they take the lead. Play ball. Digging in to try it again, Sean Fields. He went deep in his first at-bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. And that's been the entire offense so far in this one. They've been shut down other than that. First offering on its way. Now.
Now the pitch. Fouled away. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Find some green, baby. Find some green. The count is one and two. Hey, let her fly, let her fly. I got the count, two and two. He started this guy backwards, couple of off-speed pitches early, followed by back-to-back -back heaters. Right he can go either way he wants to go right now. Skied into straightaway right. Gilliam is there, one away. What's the play ball? He's out! So striding forward now, now Woody back. Lopez. The second baseman, Woody the one two swing and a flare hit toward right and that's in there base hit and that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now well that's what's so disappointing as a pitcher d row you make a really good pitch and yet four, four. take your base hey your pitch digging is. in Sean Fields. He flew out in his last at bat. First pitch of the at bat. He'll start him here with a changeup, but it's taken for ball one. Fourth inning here, already a five to two score. And that's into the corner, a foul ball in right. The 1 1 home. Hit hard toward the get right up, side. Up, and that is down Round for extra ball, bases as this will get one home and maybe right, two. Ease up, ease up. He's in at second hey, nice safely hit, as a run also comes in to score, making it a two-run ball game. So now time will be called as we're going to get a visit from the pitching coach here as he'll hope to settle his guy down. Riding in once again, Nick Ames, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Hey, see you in a rip it up there. A bouncer up the middle. There you go. You're here. You're here. And it's in time to get him. But they cut the deficit to one as a run does come across to score. A simple ground ball to the infield, but the run does come home from third, and they cut their deficit to only one run. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Cade Savick, now as back. he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly, and the inning is over. Sean Fields will stand in again, but first we'll flash you back to the very first the inning of the ball game. And here you go, a solo home run that had him off and running early on. One ball, no strikes the count. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. One and one. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Hey, you got it. No one better. Let's go. Here it comes. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Gilliam is there to put it away for route number one. Play ball. He's safe. Ready for another shot now. Caleb Coward. A hit in two at-bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Coward. This is in the air out to right. Long run for the right fielder. He gets there to put it away, but the runner breaks for third. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. Let's play ball. So a pivotal moment here and digging in now, Sean Fields. And he does so representing the possible go-ahead run. All right, here we go. Get your ribbies. Hey, let her 
flag there, huh? Hey, keep it going. Catch up for us. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Line to the right side. And that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Well, I think it's safe to say the ice is melted on this guy. He had been cold coming into this game. But that being his third knock, I guarantee you my man's smiling on the inside. Your turn. Driving the end. Now riding into the box, Nick Ames. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. When a guy's been swinging the bat as well as he has in this series, you definitely want to take the bat out of his hands. A free pass to first is better than what he's been doing the last couple of games. Now batting. Standing in with the bases loaded, Kate Savick, as he'll do his best to bring home the go-ahead run from third, 90 feet away. The 1-1 home. Hit to first. Oh, and it eats him up Hold a bit. On. Hold it right there. And he's out on the tag. But they are able to tie it up late here as a run scored on the play. I like that he didn't try to do too much there. All he needed was a ground ball to tie this thing up, and that's exactly what he does. That's great situational hitting. The left field. So digging in now, Cam Gibson. Damn. Two hits in four attempts to this point. Hops this one up. And that will fall as he comes through. It's a base hit. He beats the tag safe. And they've taken the lead here in the eighth. Boy, those have to feel really good, d -Row. You get late in the game, you come up with a big RBI base hit right here to give your team the lead. Yeah, no one remembers that ground ball with eyes in the top of the second inning. You want to show up when the game is on the line. Can you quiet? Three. Your attention, please. Now at the plate, Trey Ambergy. He's working on bringing home the tying run no standing at second base. Trey. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. A ball that's carrying. He's got it as the tying run is left on base. Danger averted following the two-out double. More to come on the show. Coming to the plate now, Sean Fields. And we'll see if he can get something into the gap to make it interesting. He's had a great game so far, but needs the triple to complete the cycle. A step on the bag for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, the side is retired. You might think it's just another win, but it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find a way to get it done, and they should be very happy with this performance. A close one, 8-7 to seven is how well, it finishes today. Erie came through late, victory. taking the A player new to his double-A squad gets a tip from one of his coaches. A player receives input from a coach. Minor League Baseball is Ryan Rollison, a southpaw from Let's Tennessee, is the man on the mound. Dan, any first. thoughts? Three. Wow, he was Three. awfully good Four. in his Four. last Four. one. Four. A complete game victory. We'll see if he'll be as good in this one. Digging in now, Sean Fields. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. Field. 
Come on, big dog. Get your pitch. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Swung on and missed. All ones the count. Nope. That's over, ball but low. It's a ball and a strike. Got a ball, one strike. No ball offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with a bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count three. right here. Three and one. And that misses for ball four. So it's a leadoff walk here to start the second. Digging in, Cade Savick. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Cade Savick. On the ground to the right side. And that is into right field, a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Boy, that's one of the, I guess, the advantages of hitting with that hole between first and second base, D-Row. First baseman has to hold that runner on. That leaves that right side wide open. Yeah, and credit the batter right there. Nice piece of hitting right there. Not trying to do too much. He took a look at the defense and saw where it was aligned and tried to beat him. Let's go now. One time. Fields at second. Savick on at first with nobody out. Fly ball out toward left center field. Center fielder on the run. He can't get there as it falls in. And no sense risking anything here as the bases will be loaded now with still nobody out. Boy, Dero, we're looking at a big inning right here with that single. Bases are loaded, yet no runs have scored in this inning. Yeah, and that's exactly what that pitcher wants you to think. You have to eliminate the noise, Dan. Just try and drive in the guy from third base. Don't put pressure on yourself that you have to get everyone in with one swing of the bat. Pass the baton and keep the line moving. Smoke toward third. To second, but they throw it away. One run is scored. On the bag, on the bag, on the bag. And the runner from second is in to score. It's a 2-0 ball game. Errors are going to happen even at this level, but you'd like to limit them to times when they don't hurt you too much. Well, so much for that. The error brings two runs across the plate, so that did really sting. Play ball. That's the ball four. Come on, Ready right for another chance? Sean Fields. He scored after reaching on a walk in his first at bat. From the belt, the pitch. Down the left field line and deep. And that will end up a foul ball. The 0 1 on its way. Skied into straightaway right. Long run for the right fielder. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. So they strike for four runs in the inning but are denied a chance to really do damage as they leave the bases loaded. We'll go to the bottom half of inning number two. The Seawolves are out on top, four to nothing. Stepping up to the plate, Andres Velasco. It was an 0 for 4 day for him in yesterday's loss. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Fields is there, and he makes the catch for the out. Three! Three! He's out! You're out! Three! To the plate now is the designated hitter, Alex the bat, Martinez. The designated hitter, Alex The one two. Martinez. Hit the other way out toward right field. Fields is there, two down. Let's play ball. 
In now, Sean Fields. He flew out in his last at bat. The right fielder. High and tight here to begin the inning. It's ball one. Well, he's still out there to start the fifth inning, but it's been a real grind of a start for him. The pitch count is much higher than he'd like it to be, so it's hard to imagine him working really deep into this game. Pitch on the way. Soft liner towards short. Have a look. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. Play ball. Digging in once again, Sean Fields. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Drive that pitch, huh? Here you go. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And this is on the outside corner for strike one. Two men are on with two men out. Pulls this one into the air out into Come right on, field. Dig, dig. Hard, and he'll get there hard, in plenty of time hard. to put this one away. And that ends the inning. First base. Ladies and gentlemen. Leading off the inning, Andres Velasco. As they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Heading out towards shallow right. Fields is in a few steps as he takes it for the Play first ball. down. Ow. Now to the plate, Andres Velasco. The as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with Andres. a base hit into the outfield. Velasco. Skied into straightaway right. And this gets down. Extra bases. And this could change everything. Two runs are in. He pulls into third safely as three runs come across, and they'll take the lead here in the late going. Your attention, please. All set to start the ninth in this one, and next to bat will be the outfielder, Sean Fields. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. No, that's down. All right, great take, great take. Let's go, kid. One time, right here. Come on, baby, square it up. 2-0. Don't expect this pitcher to throw something over the heart of the plate. He's going to have to stay on the corners right here. Huge spot in this game. Do not miss over the heart and get beat. Fouled off. Here's the 2-1 home. Nope. Outside. Great situation right here. Leading off the inning, you got to find a way to get on base any way possible. But I don't like to take the aggression away from hitters. If it's in your zone, I want you swinging. The 3-1. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Now the 3-2 and two pitch. Hey, wait for a good one and drive and I'll pick one out. That's lifted the other way out to left. Boswell is there and he'll bring this one in. Play ball. Ow. And tonight's one run game comes to an end six to five the final. Hartford came through late taking the lead in the eighth to secure the victory. Logan Cozart gets the win in relief his second of the year. Alexander Guillen wraps it up for the save his fifth of the year. Fans are final line score. First for the victorious Yargo. Two runs, nine hits, no errors. They left five men on deck. The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Tonight, the second of three to start the week between the Erie Seawolves. Jack Weinkoop will be on the bump for game two of the series. Set to get his evening at the plate started, Sean Fields, batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. Let a rip right here. 
First delivery to him on the way. Line to the right side. But he'll barely have to move out there in right as he hauls this one in for the second out. Play ball. He's out. You're out. Into the box, Sean Fields. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Here comes the first pitch. Ground ball to second. This could be two. He's right there. One there. Relay to first in time and just like. Stepping in, Brian Servin. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Here now the 2-2. Serve Hit the other way out toward right field. Relay, Long relay, run for the right fielder. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. And he's up to third safely now, which... Stepping in and ready for another shot, the Manny Melendez. Manny. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Fields is there, two down. Let's play ball. On, Top guys. half of the sixth about to get started. And next to bat will be the, the outfielder, right Sean Fields. Hit in the air down the right field line. Right fielder is on the run. And he makes the catch in the corner. Play ball. Out. He's out. Stepping in, Sean Fields. He flew out in his last at bat. Here comes the first pitch. Hey, keep it going up there. Push up. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Boy, in a perfect spot for the splitter there. It's 0 and 2. In today's Go game, it's seeing so many right guys here. strike out and not worry about it. I'd love to see a little two-strike approach right here. Maybe shorten up a little the bit and try and force feed and something the other way. Count is one and two now. Both teams with six hits so far. Down the first baseline. He's got it. On the bag. And he'll take this one to the bag for the out. But meanwhile, the runner will move up 90 feet to third base. Let's play ball. Out. Out. Three. You're out. Three. Out. 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 You're out. Anytime you can. Led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Hammers down the save is ninth of the year. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. From my partners Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show. The show's continuing. Play ball. Out. Ready now, Sean Fields. Out. He's hitless in the first the right two field. games of the series. 0 for 8. Now a throw Field. over, and he'll dive back in safely. Hey, you can do it. No one better. Start it up. First delivery to him on the way. Hey. All one's the count. No score here as we play inning number two. Hey, be patient. Get your pitch on. Here's a look over to first. Hey. And he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. Hey, like you can up there. Like you can. Let's go. Set to deliver the Owen. Ball one. That's outside. 
Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with a bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. He's fallen oh, sorry, behind now, ball. three and one. Get your pitch, huh? Hey, get your pitch up there, kid. Let's go now. Skied into straightaway right. Weeks is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. What's the play ball? He's out. Ow. Now at the plate, Brett Boswell. Now batting. The left fielder, Brett. Well. Swinging a ball hit in the air to right field and deep back is the right fielder, but he will look up and watch this one sail out of here. This is just hey, one what? of those park. Coming to the plate now, Sean right Fields field. comes into this at bat 0 for 1 oh. in the ball game. Field. Is put in play to the right side of the infield, scooped up, and very quickly there, they're two gone to start the inning. Play ball. Three. Four, four. Take your base. Out. Three. You're out. Three. Three. He's out. Three. Out. So coming to the plate, Sean Fields. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Field. First pitch on its way. Oh, and, one. and that's cut on and missed. 0 oh, and 1. Here's a splitter that's taken for a ball. 1 and 1. A runner on first with two away. Hey, we need you right here. One time. Hey. 1 1 pitch is a splitter called strike 2. The one-two is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. Top of the order due up in the home half of the sixth. The yard goats are out on top, six to one. Striding forward now is the DH, Alex the Martinez. Alex. One out, nobody on. One out, one out. Skied into straightaway right. Right fielder giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. What's the play ball? Three. Out. You're out. He's out. Out. Ball four. Take the base. Out. You're out. 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 Three. Striding in, Sean Fields. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, Matty, big time K last time up, and it's been a tough series for him so far. You can tell he's just not seeing the ball off this team. Let's see if he can make an adjustment right here. Man, that pitch had the look of a fastball. Straight changeup, and the bottom fell out of it. Come on, big guy, one time. Here we go. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch behind 0-2 now. Runner at third here. Nobody out. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. He'll throw down to first, one away. Good pitch there, and that was a nice job by his battery mate to complete the play first after the ball hit the dirt. Play ball. Well, this one had its moments of drama and excitement. In the end, these guys came away with the victory and look on to the next one. Six to two, the final total today. The Yard Goats led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Justin Lawrence takes the win on the mound, his second of the year. 
Dario Agrizal couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. So that'll just about do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. Fans, our final line score, first for the victorious Yargo, six runs, seven hits.